Hey guys, Aaron Bennett with XFOG and we're here with uh, our buddy, you've met him before, Freddy. Uh, we've done actually, for those of you that never uh, have seen the original videos, we've got uh, sweat uh, chambers here. We put them under boiling water and we've done some really cool stress tests. So I certainly uh, encourage you to check that out if you'd like. Anyway, I wanted to introduce to you kind of the T-band. A lot of you guys have seen some of the videos already, but this is just a real quick uh, overview of what it is. It's designed to attach to paintball style masks, ski masks, things along those lines. Uh, anything with a larger band on the side and it's designed to be very, very low profile to be able to come off and operate with you wherever you go. You just grab it as one unit. And again, you don't have a lot of crap to deal with like you would with a typical headband for instance, if we were showing you something like this. Now, headband will be great if you've got no headwear, uh, if you're just running a, um, you know, like work goggles, uh, or if you've just got no headwear at all and you want to run something into a low profile goggle or anything else. But for those of you that are paintballers, skiers, uh, any type of mass that you deal with was this larger band. Um, you've got the T band, it just goes like I mentioned, the X-Fog will run as one unit. You put the unit on when you're ready to rock and roll and um, you're good to go. And then of course you tuck the tubes in. Now a lot of guys will just run the tubes literally right up under the band into the side so that you're actually, you have almost no um, real exposure to the tubes. As well, you wouldn't use this manifold, you'd be using the manifold that's side to side. So the tube would just come out, come right up underneath the band and then run in. But here's just kind of a cool little look of uh, what you're looking at with a T-band, how it operates, how it's gonna look. Uh, this guy's head is extremely long and uh, not the easiest to run this on, but uh, I think it gives you a pretty good idea. So thank you so much and um, have a great day.